We are back now at 742. We've got a high-flying adventure. NBC's Tom Costello told us this was one of the most exhilarating experiences of his life, riding with some of the world's top pilots as they practice their daring moves for the Breitling North American Air Show. They're one of the world's elite aerobatic teams. Precision, speed, daring, and perfect synchronicity. Based in France, the Breitling Jet Team performs at air shows around the world. Now, for the first time, they've come to America and invited me to fly along. My pilot, Paco Wallach, a French fighter pilot for 22 years, two years on the Breitling team. The plane, a Czech-built L-39 Albatross, used to train fighter pilots around the world. As for me, I'm a novice, my first time, and I'm a little worried about losing my breakfast. How many G's are you going to put me through today? I think between maybe four, we're going to be smooth. I mean, you <laughs> promise? <laughs> yes. After strapping me in and showing me how to pull the eject handle, something I have no interest in actually trying, we're off. Here we go. We're up. We are about uh, 100 feet. We're at 200 feet. The sixth aircraft in a formation of seven, and that's what sets this team apart. Very few teams fly seven aircraft this close in loops and rolls. Left barrel. Left barrel. A left barrel is a twisting roll up and over the top, the ocean sliding over my head. Wow, that is unbelievable. At 4G's, the blood quickly runs from your head to your knees. I was really hoping not to get sick. Are you okay, Tom? Yes, sir, I'm fine. Yoo -hoo. But I was more nervous about how close we were to the other planes. How close are we to this guy? Oh, uh, we are 10 feet, Tom. Just 10 feet away. Yeah. It's a tightly choreographed ballet. Change formation. That Breitling is taking to air shows across the country. Maximum speed on these planes, 465 miles per hour and 80 Gs. Flying in the plane next to us, former space shuttle commander and Navy pilot Mark Kelly. To fly seven airplanes like that in a loop, that's, that's pretty remarkable. They are very good together and they're really special pilots. Finally, back on the ground. Oh, the air feels good. <laughs> that was fantastic. Fresh air after the ride of a lifetime. For today, Tom Costello, NBC News, East Haven, Connecticut. Wow. He kept his breakfast down. He didn't use the bark Amazing. bag. That's good. <laughs> we all have the same thought. I can't believe how close they are. Ten, ten feet ten away feet. from each other. Oh, yeah. Spinning no formations. For I mean, you get some turbulence and that could cause problems. Brave man. Tom oh, Costello. Who could pass him a note?